Oh, here's your spin. Clap twice. <laughs> All right. Good morning, welcome to Board Game Barrister, our local game shop in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. It's Tuesday once again, and every Tuesday we get to play a game. Today we've played 800 Pound Gorilla, a game where we're going to be grabbing crazy gorillas off the table, coconuts and bananas, and we'll talk about how it works in just a second here. It's very silly, it's from the creators of Taco Cat Goat Cheese Pizza. I'm here with my fellow barristers, Glenn, Elizabeth, Ian, and Gordon, and we're going to get into it. Welcome to 800 Pound Gorilla, a very silly game of saying silly phrases, doing silly actions, grabbing coconuts and bananas out of the center of the table, and most importantly, choosing gorillas of different sizes. And to get started, we're just going to choose someone to be the first player, and they're going to start us off by spinning this spinner in the middle of the table. Now the coconut and banana results on the spinner work pretty similarly. Whenever we see coconut or banana, that means we're going to refer to the card on the top of the banana point stack and say the phrase if it's a phrase or do the action if it's an action. So in this case, we've got a phrase in this speech bubble. It says boing boing. So everybody's going to try to say boing boing as fast as they can. And in this case, grab a coconut. Everyone who manages to grab a coconut, and it's a max of one coconut per player, is gonna get a banana point for this round. So we're just gonna take the top card there, turn it into a banana point and score that. And lastly, the real meat and potatoes of this game is going to be whenever the spinner lands on one of the three gorilla spaces. So we've got a tiny gorilla, a big gorilla, and a medium-sized gorilla. And what these mean are we're looking through all the gorillas on the table for either the smallest, the largest, or the most medium-sized gorilla. How do we know who got the biggest? Well, they've got their actual poundage on the back. So mine was the 788. That's a pretty big gorilla, but somebody else might have beaten me. Smallest gorilla works exactly the same way, except we're looking for the smallest. And then the mediumest gorilla means that everybody who doesn't have the largest or smallest gets points. That is literally all there is to this game. We're just going to keep scoring those banana points to reveal new things we have to say or do as we go. And the game ends as soon as we run out of gorillas or run out of banana points. Here's yeah. nope. oh. Tiny gorilla! He looks really small. Yeah, that's good. I'll take this guy. It's a, no, it's I not. Feel oh, it's so this. bad. 707. Oh. 20. 24. 702. Uh, oh! Uh, I got second, though. Second's okay. Yeah. All right, so we just finished our game with five players. Five felt amazing for this game. It plays three to six, and like if you can get more people around the table grabbing at coconuts and trying to pick out gorillas, it's just perfect. Uh, the one limiting factor would be that you want to make sure everybody can reach the actual board and the coconuts and the gorillas and stuff like that and be able to do that quickly. So if you're playing at a limiting space, then more players might not make sense for you, but in general, just aim for higher. Jeez! Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, yeah. Why can't <laughs> Is it me? It's yeah. you. So normally I'm the one that advocates for, for kids games, and I think this game is phenomenal for kids and families, and I think it's a really fun one to play with them, but the way that you have to have your attention focused on several different things at the same time, whether it's analyzing gorilla size, matters a lot, or if it's speed-based doing an action, saying a word, and grabbing a thing before everybody else does, really leans well into a, an adult drinking game. Um, and I think that this will be perfect for that group that wants to play something that they've got to pay attention to and everybody's got to stay focused on, but then they get to have a goofy fun time while they're getting intoxicated. Yeah, yeah. Bark, bark, ruff, ruff. <laughs> I don't even want this point. Bark. <laughs> I just love the conceit that the gorillas are all different sizes because they're one pixel different. <laughs> so, so you have this. I'm gonna try and find the gorilla that's smaller than. There, there you can't tell. You can't no, tell. It's no, all yeah. functionally random. But you're trying to figure it out. Yeah. And you know, you know, you can just take something. And I just love that idea that then in the end you have this kind of random reveal and you have this all these great moments. Of, oh, I got it. Or, oh, I'm one off. And I just think that's so much fun. I actually like that they've got the different like backgrounds. So it also is an illusion. It's like messing up. You can't really like compare these two because there's all these different graph backgrounds on the different gorillas, kind of throwing your eye off. You're not so bad. I'm sorry, See, little Gordon, guy. He gets all the good gorillas. Uh, well, so He's a good again, gorilla I, estimator. No, the two that I won, I took without looking. Oh, I took. Oh, I, I only saw the corner. Right, strategies exactly. coming out of your phone. Yeah. You do get some nice components in here. You got the nice bananas here, which are nice and squishy and easy to grab. But then you got the coconuts, which are fun because, as happened in our game, you can grab and it goes sliding across the table or onto the floor, and then you got people scrambling for it on the floor. Um, and you can know, pack a ton into that little box. The bananas have cute little faces. Yeah. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> this is the closest you've ever been to food. I was waiting for that. Roll that beautiful girl 
And that was 800 Pound Gorilla. Thank you so much for joining us this week. That was amazing. Um, we had a fantastic time with this one, and we hope you had a fun time watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe to see videos every week. Check out our online store and all that good stuff. We will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Nice. Nailed it. Yeah.